Hey everyone, I'm Ron from Cardeno.com and in this tutorial I'll show you how to measure counts in NetSuite. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more useful tutorials and let's get started. So the first thing to do is to go to Lists, Accounting, Accounts. And then you need to choose the account to merge. So I created one for this tutorial, my account to merge. So I will click on the Edit button. And then you need to initiate the merge from the actions list, which is here. So you see actions, merge. On the merge accounts page, you select the account into which you want to merge the account, which you can see here in this drop down. Only similar account types will appear in this list. So here the only account that appears is the one I created for this demo, which if you find this video helpful, don't forget to like it, please. Thank you. So once you are ready, you select the account, in my case it's the only one, and then you will click save, you will have a prompt and you click OK to confirm the merge. Some important considerations to keep in mind. One, the reconciliation. Merging bank and credit card accounts automatically unreconciles the reconciled transactions in the merge from account. You must reconcile these accounts. You also must make sure to visit coleno.com for more tools uh, and information to enhance your accounting processes. And third, uh, the restrictions, you cannot merge summary accounts or certain specific accounts, such as accounts payable, accounts receivable, inventory asset, etc. By following these steps, you can efficiently merge accounts in NetSuite and ensure your financial records are accurate and consolidated. Thank you for watching.